So we are now going to invite uh, Nirudhya herself, Nirudhya Sandhani Amaradivakara Samara Singha on stage for the graduate speech. Keynote speaker, Professor Sampath Amratunga, University Grants Commission, Sri Lanka, Professor E. A. Virasinghe, Vice Chancellor of NSDM Green University, Professor Chamind Ratnayaka, Deputy Vice Chancellor of NSDM, Professor Bharata Dodankotua, Head Academic Development and Quality Assurance, Deans, Heads, Distinguished Guests, academic staff, non-academic staff, parents, and my fellow graduates. A very good evening to all of you. On behalf of the graduating class of 2021, UGC Batch 9, I feel greatly honored to stand before you to deliver the convocation speech. Let me start off by saying congratulations to the shining stars this evening. We did it and it is now time to celebrate our achievement. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause to the proud graduates. <laughs> After four years, we have finally accomplished a major milestone in our lives. It wasn't only knowledge we gained throughout these years. We all grew into confident, mature, young adults, ready to make an impact in the technological world. NSBM has been a ticket to a better life. This place inspired us to spread our wings and fly high. You challenged us to come out of our shells and to be courageous and independent. You tested our capabilities boosted our self-esteem, and built lifelong friendships. First, I would like to pay my gratitude to our Vice Chancellor, Sir, Professor E. A. Veera Singha, for gifting this fully-fledged state-of-art university campus to the nation. NSBM is the ideal setting for courageous young individuals to grow into global graduates. Your visionary leadership strength, and guidance helped us complete our journey here at NSBM. Deputy Vice Chancellor, Professor Chamindu Ratnayaka, dear sir, your guidance and support throughout these past four years have, are noteworthy. I appreciate and thank you for your wise words, love, and attention you have given us. Head of Academic Development and Quality Assurance, Professor Bharata Dodankotua. You have always been a vibrant, cheerful personality interacting with students. Thank you for assuring the quality of education provided to us during these years. Allow me to go back in time. After completing my advanced levels in 2017, I was a hopeless youngster who was discouraged and miserable. Although I have received good results, I did not have the opportunity to undertake the degree I wanted to pursue. In that state, I never imagined me being able to follow my passion. On a beautiful September morning, my parents decided to visit NSBM during an open day which was a major turning point in my life. Stepping onto the campus, I was in awe with the lush greenery and the majestic buildings that gave this campus the appearance of a foreign university. This place was filled with cheerful young adults with a prominent smile on their face. Enrolling at NSBM Green University, I was able to begin my adventure towards my goal and become a smart, sophisticated student. 
Graduation day reminds me of everyone who was a part of my journey. It would have been dull and incomplete without you. Dean, Faculty of Computing, Dr. Asikaranavira. Dear sir, you are the shining light of FOC. You were a loving teacher and a mentor, always greeting us with a warm smile that made our days even brighter. Your wise, encouraging words pushed me to my destination. Thank you for being a role model to all of us. My entire life, I have been blessed with amazing teachers. And coming into NSBM, I met this wonderful set of lecturers who made my undergraduate journey remarkable. Our lecturers here at NSBM nudged us in the proper direction, but you never abandoned us on the way towards our goal. You were dedicated and an inspiration to all of us. Working remotely during the epidemic was a tough situation for all of us. Nevertheless, our lecturers managed to deliver lessons in a consistent basis, which is really admirable. Along with studies, career fairs, career counseling. Industry visits were scheduled, creating pathways for us to apply for the jobs we desired. You were the greater source of knowledge. Thank you for being our educator, our mentor, our friend, and our family. Ladies and gentlemen, these amazing lecturers truly deserve a hand from us. Non-academic staff made a silent impact in our lives here at NSBM. I simply cannot express how grateful I am for you for assuring the health and safety of the students and creating a healthy environment for us to continue our studies in comfort. Your hard work and cheerful demeanor will forever be etched in our hearts. Dear Amban Tata, you are the pillars of my life my role models, who encouraged me to be the best version of myself. I feel so honored and blessed to have you both as my parents. Whenever I was ready to give up, you were my source of strength, pulling me up. Thank you for always believing in me, and I hope today I made you proud. I especially would like to mention my best friend, Sulakkana. Throughout these years, you have been my cheerleader, my support system. You pushed me towards my goal. Thank you for making this journey memorable. My fellow batchmates, for me, you all have been the best part of my undergraduate journey. We were each other's strength, happiness, and together we all created so many memories that I will cherish throughout. Thank you for your wonderful personalities and big hearts. And most importantly, thank you for your presence in my life. Exams, endless submissions, coupe sessions, backstabbers, gossip, and fun events made our university life pretty amusing. But along the way, we all had to make so many compromises. Miracle is just another word for hard work. Be proud of you achieving your goals and making your loved ones proud. Finally, I would like to pay my tribute to our loving parents. It must feel like yesterday you took us to preschool and today your sons and daughters have become outstanding graduates, future leaders. Thank you for your unwavering love for us. I'm pretty sure it must have been tough at times but I hope today we all proved that your tears and effort were well worth it. Dear friends, as we close this chapter in our lives, it is time for a new beginning. Remember to follow your passion, do what you enjoy, do what makes you happy, but especially remember to do what is right. Nothing worthwhile comes easily, but that does not mean we should give up on ourselves. Keep charging your way forward to the top. You are capable of changing the world, and I know you are worth it. 
Good luck in all your endeavors. As I've reached the end of my speech, I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate and wish my university, NSBM Green University, all the best in its endeavor and to raise its name in the global education. Thank you and have a wonderful evening.